Here, let's talk about creating data links in Civil 3D. There's various ways you could do this. First, going through the Ribbons tab, you can create a data link to a new file. I'm just going to give this a quick name, call it Test1. And then it's going to ask me, where is this file? I actually have created one in a project. Select that. I'm going to select the entire sheet for this. It's going to preview what's in there, and that looks about right. Hit OK. Hit OK. Now, to place the link, I need to create a table. That's under the annotation tab in the ribbon, click table. We're going to do from a link. I've got test one. There's the preview. And, and this is how to bring it in as a file or as a table with AutoCAD entities. Um, another way to do this is to actually go right through the Excel spreadsheet. So if I open that spreadsheet up, I can just select the cells that I want. Right click, copy. Then under the edit tab, I can paste special. I can paste as a link. To an Excel word sheet, worksheet. Looks like that. It's a little bit more locked down. Um, another way to do it, again, under Pay Special, if you want to get a table. And it's just like the other one without having to go through. Uh, setting up the link manually. Um, one of the nice things about uh, using OLEs is how easy it is to get into the spreadsheet while you're in AutoCAD. So just double, let me close this out real quick. Excel's been closed. If I double click on it, it will then open it up. I can then come in here, make that bold, maybe give it a different size title. Maybe let's format that to the middle, and maybe we'll put another border around that. Hit save, hit close, and this is already up to date. This is one of the reasons I like using the OLE, um, as it allows me to um, see my updates without having to come down here and click update link um, even if I come here you'll notice you notice that these headings got a little bolder bigger but they didn't quite format the same way so if you prefer using Excel to edit your table you might use OLE if you don't mind working with AutoCAD tables um, you can you can insert them this way. Um, one advantage is to tables is it gives you independent control um, over formatting the cells. So if you want to edit this differently than the way it looks uh, in the spreadsheet, um, data links will uh, using tables will allow you to do that. I hope you found this informative. Thanks for watching.